Hey there, it's Beta Squared. Welcome back to more Earthbound. We are in super endgamey territory right now because we are in on it and it has been invaded by a plethora of aliens. And it, relatively, we should be generally okay, but this is not a place you want to come to anymore. And one of the reasons being is because these enemies will destroy you. It's a very good place to grind, but hopefully I don't get myself killed because of the, the shield. I guess I didn't get killed because there's no shield. Maybe... Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not gonna be good. I think my plush bear is dead too. There goes that plush bear. And please kill him. Kill him. Oh god. Paula, do not die. We're just gonna ignore everything and move on because I'm just gonna heal everyone on the way up there. But this. Oh my Jesus. Lord. Okay, oh, that's a really good way to heal up enemy, our, our friends. But this is not gonna be fun. My legs got itchy for a second. I have a lot- I've noticed I have a lot of PSI. So I'm gonna just fucking go all out in this episode. I'm gonna bash the shit out of these enemies. Because all we need is a few- just a few. PSI to leave as soon as we get the meteorite piece. Um, what's what's that gonna do? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! Don't don't PSI rocking on my friends. Oh, okay. We'll just bash. That kind of didn't work out in my favor. That's not super on horrible either, but we're progressing. Jesus. What the fuck? Oh my god. That is bullshit. I, I call shenanigans. I call shenanigans. Alright. They generally all have like... Actually, yeah, they generally all have 750 health. So... They shouldn't be too difficult to deal with. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's just fucking use Starstorm. Like, this mess can just heal all everyone. Everyone is, like, fine with the Nessa's ability to heal everyone. The problem is, is the evil eye is just... He's just an asshole. He is literally just an asshole. Alright, what do you... What do you want to do? And that should take them both out. Unfortunately, Ness is kind of like not sure what to do with his life. And I'm just getting more levels, which is honestly really great. Because I don't. It's not like I need them. But the end game kind of gets grindy in a sense. Where there's so many enemies. There's like so many. Like, it's, it's not worth your time to run away. It is not worth your time to run away. It is... Like, I, I did that in a previous episode. You see where it got me? You see exactly where it got me. I can't even... Can I do... Oh, fuck it. I'm just gonna freeze that guy. Because I probably shouldn't do... PK Rock and Omega. Mainly because I'm gonna waste all my energy and... Before I even get to the top of the mountain, then I'm gonna kind of be fucked. Kind of be fucked. And I don't want that to happen. I don't want that to happen. Thankfully, I have a lot of plush bears. Actually, I only buy two, because I kind of know that two is generally a good number. Two is a good number. I think we're halfway up the mountain by now. Wow, there's not, no, not a lot of enemies. And as soon as I say that, of course, my luck turns, and there's a lot of enemies. A lot of- oh! That made it worse! That made it worse. But we're just gonna bash him. Hopefully, everything goes well. 
PK Starstorm Alpha. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh-oh. And there goes all my friends. Bash! Bash, you fools! Oh, fuck. Bash, you fools. Uh-oh. Okay, we're good. Everything's cool, don't worry about it. Everything's fine. Everything's dandy. Uh, we'll just do that again. Everyone's HP will max out. We'll be okay. And we don't have a plush bear anymore. Damn it, I, want, I wanted to get away with this, but I, apparently I can't. Ah, <sighs> I'm just sad now. Okay, we're gonna do that on you and shoot you with the bazooka. I know I'm not... No, wait, what am I doing? I want to shoot this guy with the bazooka and PK freeze this man. We're almost to the top. I know we are. That's for sure. Oh, wait, did I PK freeze the same enemy twice? Yeah. yeah. Okay. That worked out in my favor completely. Like, honestly, completely. Because I know the Ghost of Starman also have a one in... Like, oh, I got a green swirly! And I don't think... Ah, uh, the green swirlies are my favorite swirlies. That means we can just casually get through this battle without having to worry about anything. I kind of threw this playthrough out the window when I chose a different file. That's not the right way. And... Don't come, don't come! Damn it! Damn it! Alright, we're gonna bash you, and we're gonna have you do PK Freeze Omega on the Ghost of Starman. Because I don't want you to move during this whole battle. When I say I threw this whole playthrough out the window... Fuck, what is wrong with you? Why do you keep doing that? Okay. Is that it? Uh-oh. Oh, Jesus. Everyone, PSI... Freeze! You! Goods! Heavy bazooka! You! Bash! I don't care! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dang it! Oh, fuck. Whatever, man. That's what the horn of life is for. I'm sorry that you had to die. I'm sorry that you had to die, Paula. I mean, this is just the way life goes. You're alive and then you're dead. I don't think this has happened, like, at all. The problem is, is that Paula is just so weak, no, no matter at what point you are in this playthrough. Thankfully I have this and I can just use it on Paula and she come back, come back to life. And I can just do PK life up on her and completely heal her, just to be sure. We're not even- oh, there it is. Home stretch! And there's not even a single enemy in, in this space. Alright, there's something shiny. Yes, we want to take that. There you go, we got the Xenonite. The meteorite piece. Alright, how do I get out of here? Uh, we're gonna teleport right to Saturn Valley. This, this is it. This is the point. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. Where do I have to be standing to like... To like not get destroyed? Is this the, the, the spot? There you go, that's the spot. Perfect. Alright. Before I do that, before I do anything... Yes, I want to slumber because I am in desperate need of health. We are reaching the point of absolute no return. As soon as we give this piece to Dr. Andonuts, we enter, a, uh, like, the Phase Distorter 2.0, or whatever it's called, where we go into the cave of the past. A part that I showed previously. Yes, I, I want to buy more Horns of Life. And, uh, I guess Paula will be carrying it. Is there anything else you want? Uh, yes, I do. I, I want another Horn of Life. Next time on Earthbound, I'm gonna be stocking up for endgame material. Uh, no? What do you have to say? Welcome to the automatic talent machine. Oh, wow, I have a lot of money. No, I don't want that much money. I don't need that much money. <sighs> okay, that is honestly it for this session. 
Next session might be the very end of the Let's Play, which I'm sorry I put off for a very long time, but look, we're here now, we have finished so much of this game, and it has been an incredible journey. Some episodes I have not been super happy about myself, but this, this has been a blast. Honestly, I know no one really watches me, I know I don't really get to say much because I'm so small, but... Thank you guys so much for watching, honestly. I appreciate it, I really do.